is the Lord. Because of our visitors, I want to say some things. Uh, I welcome you to Deeper La Bible Church of Charlotte Way. I know you you have been seeing me for a long, long, long time. <laughs> and at last, uh, I thank God you are able to be here today. Uh, Deeper La Bible Church is a very big church. And then when you look at the address that is on our car, on the bus, you will see that it's from Washington, D.C. So our headquarters is in Washington, D.C. Uh, Sister Lisa, uh, uh, the Mentrek, and then uh, Sabi, they have visited the place. That's our headquarters in Washington, D.C. Here we are struggling. Then, uh, we are struggling to establish ourselves due to the lack of workers. And then you will see that I come to pick you up. And then, if not because of you, my son will be in charge. But because this is your first time, I want you to know that uh, I'm still in charge. He is just helping me. So on Sunday like this, uh, you know America, you need to be begging people to come to church. <laughs> so that's one thing in the United States, unlike Africa. But on Monday, uh, you can see that, uh, 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 what is her name, is not here. She always come on Monday, and then Moya is not here, and then we have a lot of people who are not here today. As I told you, in the United States, you need to be begging people to come to church, except those people who are committed. So uh, one thing I want to tell you is that you will see that this place is a place of you can explore it. You can work for God. There's no way you can avoid it. Because you know me, I know you. So uh, it's a real, except you don't want to work for God. There's no way you can avoid it. So, and that's the reason why I want to encourage you that by the grace of the Lord, you will do all what you can do to continue to be part of us, to exploit for God. Especially when you look at your environment, you will see that uh, in that environment, we need God. We need God. We need a lot of people that they need to be touched by God. And this should be your passion. This should be your dream. This should be the, oh, what can I do to help this environment so that more people can know God? And then it is my belief that as, as this call, Clarion call is coming on to you, you will obey the force of the Lord. You will hear the voice of the Lord, and you will want to do the will of the Lord by bringing as many people as possible to the church. And then I know God is going to help you in Jesus' name. I want you to know that we are going to be there for us, as we believe that you are going to be. Uh, you are going to be here for us every Sunday. We come by eight thirty to come to come and pick people. Then on Monday, I come by 6.30 to come and pick them for Bible study. And then I will take them back. As you know, we provide the fresh uh, meal. And then you know, you have seen my body. You have seen my work in your environment. That I don't have my, that environment is part of my life. And God will continue to help us in Jesus' name. So once again, I welcome you to the Palais Bible Church of Charlotte. Faith. The joy of the Lord will continue to be with you. The, the mercy of the Lord will continue to be with you. I don't want you to look at the vacant chair. I want you to look at what can I do for this church to grow. And God is going to help you. God is going to help me in Jesus' name. I have to say that 
Uh, let us pray. Let us rise up to pray. Let us rise up to pray. Our mighty Father, we glorify your name. We thank you, Lord, because you are Lord of Lord, the King of King. We thank you, Lord, because of what you are doing in our life and what you will still continue to do. Almighty Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Father, we are here this morning, though we are few. We know by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, spiritually, you are going to increase us in Jesus' name. And your name is going to be glorified. For those who are not here today, Father, we pray you will bring them in the name of Jesus Christ. For your son, your servant, I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, uh, she will, he will not lose hope in the name of Jesus Christ. He will continue to be focused. And he will take us to the destination in Jesus' name. We thank you, Lord, because of the faithfulness you have provided. We know our place of worship. Father, you will provide it to you in the name of Jesus Christ. And your name is going to be glorified. Thank you, Lord, because you are the Lord that answer prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We shall open our aim to um, one... We are singing from gospel hymn and songs, number 126. Gospel hymns and songs, number 126. Great God of wonders. Great God of wonders, all thy ways display the attributes divine for countless acts of pardoning grace. Beyond thy other wonders shine. Who is, a, who is a pardoning God like thee? Or who has grace so rich and free? In wonder lost, with trembling joy, we take the pardon of our God, pardon for crimes of deepest dye, a pardon bought with Jesus' blood. Who is a pardoning God like thee? Or who has grace so rich and free? Pardon from an offended God. Pardon for sins of deepest dye. Pardon bestowed through Jesus' blood. Pardon that brings the, the bell near. Who is a pardoning God like thee? Or who has grace so rich and free? Oh, may this, oh, may this strange, this matchless grace. This godlike miracle of love fill the white heart with grateful praise, as now it fills the choirs above. Who is a pardoning God like thee? Or who has grace so rich and free? <laughs> 